What is going on guys, it's your boy JPT FIFA here, we're going to be doing a video on the two foot birthday cards which are Bakayoko and Cordoba. The first one we're going to get into here is Bakayoko, we've got squads for both of them so I'll leave um, a timestamp for both of the squads in the um, comments. So like, so if you guys want to just go straight to that, um, it's always there for you. Um, for the first one here, for Bakayoko, we've got physical passer. Assist the goal in three separate rival matches using French players with a minimum 80 physical. Sissoko comes to the top of my head. Um, let me think if there's any more. Not, I can't really think of any at the moment, but I definitely know Sissoko's got 89 physical because he's in my squad. Um, you get a two players pack for that. Anyway, um, the next one, skillful finisher. Score a finesse goal in two separate rival matches using league and players with four star skill moves. Pie it. Bang on for that. Goal player pack. Oh, just goal pack even. Next one, French facilitator. Assist two goals in five separate rival matches using French players with Foss our weak foot. Uh, Pie it again, fair enough. Um, small election players pack for that. Um, weak foot wonder, score and assist in seven separate rival matches, wins even, using midfielders for Foss as weak foot. Pie it again, bang on the money for these three objectives. They're all the same packs as well that you would get for the um, Bellarabi um, objectives. Obviously, that's not um, here anymore, but they're the exact same packs. And I assume this will, obviously, so this is um, Div Rivals. Cordoba, probably going to be um, Squad Battles, like Quetta was. Um, so this is the Bellarabi of the last objectives, and Cordoba, who we'll go on to now, will be the um, Louis, uh, not Louis Adriano, Lucas Paqueta um, card from the last objectives. Um, so, Hattrick Habro, score three goals in squad battle match on minimum world class difficulty, simple, easy, you can do that in one game, obviously, like it says. Um, Colombian class, uh, scoring three separate squad battle matches on minimum world class difficulty using Colombian players, you get a goal pack for that, uh, really simple. I reckon Cordoba will go up to about 1.5k, he'll probably stop at there. Um, most players have a ceiling price, so I reckon that's where Cordoba will stay. Um, the next one, forward finesse. Score two, f uh, two finesse goals in five separate squad battle wins on minimum world class difficulty using Brazi uh, Bundesliga, not Brazilian. Bundesliga players with four star skill moves. Havertz comes in mind, Stancho. Um, two good ones there that come in mind to me. You get a small Electrum players pack for that. The last one, World Class Drive, score two low driven goals in seven separate squad battle wins on minimum world class difficulty using French forward, uh, French again, I am wild then today. World Class difficulty using forwards with four star skill moves and four star weak foot. <sighs> Sancho again. Um, sorry about that. Um, we'll just get into the uh, squads now though. Um, yeah, we'll just get into the squad. Um, it'll be quite easy now. So, the first one here, we've got uh, Bakayoko, I believe, yeah. Um, so, in goal, starting, we've got Rufier, 84. Left back, uh, left centre-back, we've got um, Kimpembe. Right back, uh, right centre-back, Diallo. Right back, Aguilar. Um, left back, Bernat. CDM, Sanson, who, this is the start of the 4-star, four 4-star, four so Sanson for the CDM. Right mid, Balde, 4 star, 4 star. Left wing, Gradle, 4 star, 4 star. Paye, uh, Paye even. You can just use a normal card, you don't have to be, use the ultimate screen, but he's 4 star, 4 star too. And then two really good strikers, Ben Yedda and Dembele. Um, if you do have cards like Cyprium from the League SBC, or Mbappe, if you're just somebody like that, then use them both by all means. Uh, great cards, um, in general. Um, Bakayoko will really help you guys in the squads as well, so um, watch out for that, because if you can fit him in your team, I'll suggest going for him. Um, we're going to the next one here, Cordoba. Um, so this is the team for Cordoba. We've got Pavlenka in goal. Um, Akanji on the left centre-back. Jonathan Tarr right back, uh, right centre-back. Klosterman right back. Angelino left back. Zakaria CDM. Sancho, the first start of the four-star, four-star. Or four, five star, four star for him, obviously. But um, Sancho, Cam, Julian Brandt, four star, four star. Left mid, Perisic, four star, five star. 
striker, Cordoba, whichever one you want to use for him. Um, you can use any card really, but you don't need to create a team for Cordoba. You can just um, sub him on and sub somebody like Sancho on to help you do that. And then at striker, we've got Timo Werner for the pace. Um, two players you could use for it as well. Vestrat, um, apparently he's really good from people that I've been talking to. Um, from the um, one where you have to score with each team in the um, Bundesliga twice. Or some, something like that. Um, I don't know what objective it comes under though. Um, Bellarabi, the uh, foot birthday one, if you did go ahead and do him. Um, we've already talked about him, but he's a nice card as well. Um, we're going to compare Bakayoko and Cordoba here. Which one's worth getting first? We'll see now. So Cordoba, 6 foot 2, 5 star skills, 3 star weak foot. Decent, to be fair with him, right footed as well. Great sprint speed, decent acceleration. <sighs> Shooting stats are really good. I'm just taking this all in because this is my first time viewing this. Really decent shooting stats there. Passing could be better, but I like the short pass idea there from EA. Dribbling could be... Actually, no. No, that could be better. Apart from the agility, I think that's decent. Balance could be a, a little bit better. I'm not too sure about that, though. Heading actual accuracy in the defending stats for some reason. That should be in shooting. But um, heading accuracy, decent. I think, it, I'm pretty sure, he should have... From these stats here, 87 jump and 88, uh, 85 heading accuracy. He should have power header. Yeah. Um, physical, stamina 80, 97 strength, 99 aggression. Yeah, I'm really angry. Um, yeah. That that honestly, that is one of the better cards I've seen for foot birthday and just any real free card and objectives at all. Um, I would suggest getting him, but I'm not, I, I'll tell you which to get first, obviously, now. Bakayoko, 6 foot 2, 5 star weak foot, 3 star skills. Um, what foot is he? Right foot, okay. M wait, what's his? Medium, medium, and then Cordoba was high, high. Okay. Um, decent pace for, like, a CDM, I guess. He's not great at finishing in general. Nah, a shooting out the bet isn't the best, but obviously a CDM's to do defended the physical. Passing, some things could be better, like rossing could be a little bit better. Dribbling, great apart from balance, which is quite annoying. Defending, really good, and physical, really good. So, compared to Cordoba, I would say Cordoba first, as he's an easier card to grind, get, go and get, um, sorry. Um... I, honestly, I think I would prefer Cordoba, but Cordoba doesn't really fit into my squad, whereas Bakayoko does. Um, but both qu quite simple objectives, not like the Quetta and Bellarabi, they were quite confusing. But um, yeah, all around, I think that's a really good in um, investment from EA, um, to put the time in to um, make these cards. What I do want to say is, um, let me know what you think about um, the new team in the comments below. Obviously, we've got Pogba, Van Dyke, and stuff like that, um, and Lacazette. Let me know what you think of that. Um, I will be shouting out the first five comments in the next video. Um, but apart from that, thank you for watching. I've been your boy, JPT, and uh, I'm out. Peace.